Hi, my name is Troy. I'm 43 years old and I suffer from the disease of bad choices. Um, you know, it started when I was a kid and I didn't want to eat my vegetables. Uh, I refused to. Um, I didn't like stuff that was good for me. I wanted uh, chocolate, ice cream, candy. Um, and uh, I, I just, it, it snowballed from there when I went to school. Um, I decided to beat people up uh, on the schoolyard during recess. I was a bully. Uh, went through junior high and high school without ever really applying myself. Um, my grades were awful. Um, my attitude was, was terrible. And uh, when I became an adult, um, <clears throat> uh, I decided to uh, uh, do as little as possible to exist and survive and um, just uh, every day it seems like uh, because of my disease I don't make good choices I make bad choices um, you can't see my pants but they're brown they don't match my outfit uh, I wish that I could have worn black pants that would match more what I'm wearing, but, uh, uh, you know, like I said, uh, it's a disease I have. I make bad choices, and I can't help myself. Um, I wish I could. I would, oh, oh, oh. Oh, that's, oh, that's horrible. I, very uncomfortable. I just went the bathroom. On myself I just I just went to the bathroom in my pants I I, I didn't want to do that but <clears throat> uh, I was I was contemplating stopping this videotape and going and using the restroom which is just one door down the hall but uh, I made another bad choice and, oh oof. now I stink I, I uh, <sighs> well um, when I was getting dressed this morning, I found a half a sandwich on a dresser, and uh, it's been there for a couple of days, but it smells pretty good still. I think I'm going to go eat that now. Man, I, I wish I could control myself, but I, I just can't. I have no control. This is genetic. I was born this way, and I'm destined to make bad choices for the rest of my life. Let me ask you a question. How many times have you been told that there's things in your life that you just can't control? That there's choices that you just don't have any control over? I don't believe that. I don't believe that when you make bad choices or when you do stupid things or even when you suffer from an addiction that it's a disease. You know, some people say, well, I've got a disease. I'm not fat because I have a disease. I'm fat because I don't work out and I eat too much. It's not a disease. It's a bad choice. And I think so many times in people's lives, they could have better lives if they just make better choices. It's, it's not a matter of something you've been predestined to do because your destiny gets determined by you every day when you make choices. So I want to I want to tell you today that you can have a wonderful day. You can have an amazing day and you can start making better choices. All you have to do is you just have to discipline yourself a little bit. I know that word discipline is kind of strange to us as a as a society today because there was a time when love meant denying somebody something that could wreck them or shipwreck their lives. And today, love kind of means to different people getting what you want. Well, you know, sometimes getting what you want is just the opposite of what you need. Sometimes you need to discipline yourself and deny yourself something. Now, just the other day, I weighed myself. And, and over the course of the last couple months, I've lost 30 pounds. Now, that's not a big deal because it's like trying to drain the ocean with a teaspoon and you feel like, you know, I, I, told, I told a friend of mine that I'd lost 30 pounds and they looked at me and said, 
Really? Huh. That was very encouraging. You see, the problem is this. I can overcome some of the issues and some of the problems that I've brought upon myself through bad choices by making good choices. If I want to sit and give up and surrender and lay on the couch and watch TV and eat Doritos and say, I've got a disease, I can do that. But the truth is, I don't have a disease. I may have a genetic predisposition to overeating, but who doesn't? The truth is, I've made a lot of bad choices. And it's up to me to start making good choices. So basically today, it doesn't depend on your circumstances, and it, it doesn't really depend on how you feel. It depends on what you choose and what you do. You can make this an excellent day just by making a few good choices.